whole bunch of bitches, and <laughs> um, you know, I ended up oh. in the same place that I ended up last year. But huge difference is I walk away a showgirl as well. So honestly, that is the one main thing that I wanted. I can get all those prizes on my own. Um, congrats to Selena. She deserved all those prizes. She's a creative um, showgirl. I mean, honestly, like, I, I, I am so happy that I lost to her just because she brought it this competition. She had that competition in the palm of her hand. So um, congrats to her, but I, I'm honestly ecstatic that I'm walking away with a spot in showgirls as well because um, that's what I came here for. You'll be seeing me more. <laughs> Hopefully you like that. <laughs> ah! <laughs> what just happened? It doesn't feel real to me. I saw my picture and I was just like, damn, I look good. <laughs> it didn't process that I had one fucking project drag for. What the fuck? What the fuck? It doesn't, doesn't feel real to me right now. Like, I'm going to wake up and probably still won't feel it. I have so much ahead of me um, with this Best in Drag show that I'm doing, this fundraiser. I have, I'm going to Palm Springs this weekend for a big musical that I'm doing. I've been rehearsing for all along and like, I have so much on my schedule that this is just like, let's get tonight over with. But I fucking won. You know, while I'm on camera, I just want to thank um, all my friends who show up every fucking week for me. If it weren't for my friends, there'd be no encouragement, no like push for me to even work as hard as I worked for this whole competition. My roommate Tokyo, Patches, my best friends, everyone who came every week and just pushing me past my limits more than this competition, they are the ones who brought me to the point where I am today. And if it wasn't for them, I wouldn't be here today. And you know, I wanna thank Marta, you know, king of her ups and downs. And um, I just, you know, if it wasn't for Marta um, being her drag sister in the get from the get go when she did Project Drag, I would have no, I wouldn't be looking like this at all. You know, I've taught myself and I've come a long way, but Marta really helped me put my training wheels on. So I just wanna give you a shout out, girl, and I love you so much. Um, I can't believe it, I wanna thank Tony, I wanna thank Dallas, baby girl, I wanna thank <laughs> all of you guys for continuously just appreciate, appreciating what I'm bringing every week. You know, I wanted to do this competition. I came in to do this competition and I just, you know, I told myself I wanna be creative. I, I love, you know, what Marta got to bring every week. I wanna bring my own flavor and do my own thing twist these challenges up and do fucking something crazy every week. I just wanted to be creative and it was my creative outlet pretty much, you know. I had no intention to become a professional drag queen a year ago when I started doing it for fun, you know. And now this is kind of like, I told myself if I win this, I'm gonna really devote myself and I'm gonna have to. You know, it was a devotion doing this fucking competition. <laughs> so like the fact that I won, you know, if I didn't win, I was gonna be like, okay, good, I got to be creative and there's a job for me out there where I can be creative that way that doesn't have to involve drag and I can do it when I can. But now that I fucking won, it's like, no, bitch, here we go. It's just the fucking start, and it's gonna fucking happen. I can only get better from here. You know what I mean? I can only grow. I can only get more polished. I can only be more beautiful from here. <laughs> so I'm just so excited. I'm so excited. I just want to thank everybody. Thank you so much for continuously just believing in me and giving me that energy to give back to you and just to keep creating for you guys. So I'm just so excited to see what happens from here now. <laughs> and just remember, anything for Salina. Yeah. Yeah.